Ahoy, fellow DIYers. Um, on today's menu is the hot wire bow for my foam cutting projects. So this is the three by one imperial uh, plank. Got the route of the wire in. Uh, fiberglass rods. Soldered the uh, bullet connectors used uh, from brushless motors um, also on the wire I have the connector here uh, and the other side now um, I wanted to have a bit of a longer one so that one is 70 centimeters this one is one meter but as I tried it first to bend it over to roughly 90 centimeters uh, when I power it on the wire had a little bit too much flex so I adjusted the wire uh, to be 82 as much as I remember yeah that's 82 centimeters uh, which is will be enough for me uh, the largest thing I will be cutting is probably DLG glider wing which is one and a half meters that means 75 centimeters each wing that's as that's as far as I will go so should be enough and that's a good bit of attention there we go now I got my I got my wire I got my wire on eBay uh, but they're the same seller they on the website jacobs slash online dot biz uh, they have some wires different gauge this is the 22 gauge wire uh, don't know why I got this gauge or or whatever just experimenting basically and what's cool thing about online that they have a hot wire calculator uh, as they say 600 Fahrenheit that's 316 Celsius it's enough for cutting the foam and you put in your things and they tell you what voltage and what amp uh, amperage you need so 600 I calculated by the length of a 90 centimeters uh, that I need 11.4 volts and 3.7 amps now the larger area of course like the calculation is the theoretical and the stay still without any air or anything so obviously if you cut in a larger area you're going to need more amps you're going to need more voltage because the wire cools down so um let's give it a i checked it there let's give it a bit more of a check after the wire being shortened and there's more tension of the on the wire power on this thing that's my power supply okay I'll turn down the turn down the volume so 11.4 I have 11 and a half volts and 3.6 amps that that was calculated for 90 centimeter wire and now I have here 82 centimeter wire Oh, I like it better because the other time as you can see there's a still slack in the wire the other time it was a bit way too much nice and slow Now, I would like the wire would be a bit of a faster. Now I can still see, maybe it's just from the heating, that this side is, this side is bended. I could feel a bit of a slack. Um, let's try a bit more. 650 Fahrenheit, 12 volts. Let's try to put up a bit of voltage. What do we have here? 12 and a half volts that's supposed to be 700 Fahrenheit, 371 C Celsius centigrade. 
that's my previous testing. Oh yeah, that's that's more like it. It's still bloody slow. Maybe that's the way it has to go. If that's the pace, then I'll go with it fine. Easy. Off. There we go, it's a success, ready to build some gliders, see you next time.